The following segment is brought to you by Intermountain Healthcare and the Utah Department of Health. Okay, a lot of concerns and questions surrounding the lasting impacts of the coronavirus. And as Mary Nichols explains, doctors are learning that someone sick with coronavirus could end up with heart disease as well. People shouldn't be too cavalier about thinking, oh, I'm just going to get the virus, I'm going to get COVID, and then I'll be done with it, and I won't have it again. They need to be aware that there is the possibility that it could have more long-term effects on their heart and perhaps on other organs as well. Researchers say there is a clear link between heart disease and coronavirus, but right now they don't know the long-term implications. The good news is that viral, that heart damage from virus infection usually has a good chance of recovering more so than say if you've had a heart attack. Experts don't know yet how often the heart damage occurs or whether it only affects people with severe coronavirus symptoms. About 20 to 30 percent of people who are hospitalized though end up with some heart damage. And we're talking about people who are in the hospital, which is very different than people who have been diagnosed, stayed home, had felt, felt lousy for a week and never were admitted to the hospital. Uh, we don't know really how many of them have some evidence of heart damage. Doctors say the best thing we can do to avoid any coronavirus heart condition is to stay healthy, social distance, and wear a mask. And that, that's, that's our best uh, antidote right now to getting heart disease, is just don't get COVID. Mary Nichols for Check Your Health.